Welcome back to Why in the Morning. And if it's Tuesday, it's Entrepreneurship Tuesday at Y254 channel. Is where you can find us across all our social media handles at Michelle Ashira. Is where you can equally find me across all my social. In this festive mood, as Team Y254, we have some goodies for you. So you might walk away with 2,500 Kenya shillings. As simple as that only as simple as this just listen to me all you have to do right so it's to name all drama programs airing on y254 currently as simple as that just walk away with 2500 kenyan shillings so name all drama programs airing on y254 currently so you may answer also on our social media channels, that is on Instagram at y254 underscore channel. Head on to our Facebook page, that is y254 channel. Then, then head to our Twitter handle. Yes, Twitter handle, that is at y254 channel. As simple as that, you walk away with... 2,500 Kenyan shillings. And uh, you might never know, you might be the lucky winner. So head on to our Facebook page, Y254 channel, Y254 underscore channel on Instagram and at Y254 channel on Twitter. Yes? Yes. So festive mood, holiday season and speaking about being in the, in the festive mood, right? We also need to find ways of, of how we can create extra money and uh, one of the best ways is to start a business and in studio. I am joined by none other than Theophilus Rono. So interesting, Theophilus Rono started his own company very recently during a recession period uh, in the global pandemic, COVID-19, and he is doing quite very well. So he is the marketing director, uh, marketing manager of Faida Springs Limited. Thank you very much, uh, Theophilus, for creating time to be with us today. Thank you. Happy holidays. How are you doing? Happy holiday too. All right. It's a pleasure being here. It's, it's all our pleasure to having you in our studios today. Yes. So tell us more about uh, what you do and about this company that is booming in time of a recession period. Okay, uh, the company Faida Limited mm -hmm. is a company that uh, produces and package water, mm -hmm. uh, drinking water, mm -hmm. which is purified and uh, recommended for human consumption. All right. Yeah, we... Early on, during uh, when we were still on a break, uh, we were having a conversation, and I was telling you how I hear that it's a it's a long bureaucracy just uh, starting off a refilling plant for 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 water. So tell us, take us through the process and uh, your experience. Uh, the pre engine about uh, creating a company that is uh, deals with water production of water. Mm -hmm. uh, it's quite cumbersome. I mm -hmm. can't lie to you. Mm -hmm. And uh, the only thing you need to do is to comply. Uh, to every every requirement that is uh, put in place okay. that every company that uh, produces water wants to uh, is required to do. Mm -hmm. So for our case as Faida Limited, mm -hmm. uh, this is a company that we thought of uh, forming it in the last year, that is in the year 2020. Okay. And uh, we took the process of forming it mm -hmm. and incorporated in Kenya, that is mm -hmm. in the year 2020, that mm -hmm. is a uh, Early this year, mm -hmm. so it's an, a startup company. So you registered in 2019? Not really, okay. but you see through the process, through it's the a process. process. Oh, yeah. Registration was done Takes in 2020. Time. Takes time. Yeah. Because because of those compliance uh, yeah. requirements. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when you look at the market space, when it comes to production of water, we have so many companies in the market. So what did what what gap did you see in the market space, and how different are you doing in the in the Fida Spring Limited? You see. Uh, in every business, you need not worry about your competitor. Okay. So long as there is a gap. Because mm -hmm. we, we saw there is always a gap uh, concerning uh, supply of water and also these other companies concerning packaging. Because most of the clients do, uh, are very sensitive concerning packaging and also configuration of the name of the company. Mm -hmm. So uh, for our case, we saw the gap. And we thought it wise to come up with our own, that is Faida, Maji Faida, mm -hmm. which is uh, well recommended. It undergoes uh, through many filtration mm -hmm. process, uh, a number of them, including the ultraviolet lamps that purify water, that is uh, makes it high level of uh, quality. All right. So 
when you, someone is, start, is looking forward to start up a business, right, and uh, you have the experience of the whole process and it takes time, as you mentioned, Ed, how, how, what, how did you ensure that you're patient and still, uh, you know, very active and productive in terms of putting in the vision of the company all together to actually actualizing the company into existence? You see what always happens when you have uh, the right mind mm -hmm. to begin a business and the patience with you. The longer it takes, you don't need to worry about it because mm -hmm. you, you, you always uh, want to see the end result because mm -hmm. the means also just justify the end. And for our case, we always believe in the means. Mm -hmm. However much time it might take, but we look at the end result because uh, every right step you take, mm -hmm. you always get the right result. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. So, looking back, uh, when you're starting this company, so what, how did you come up with your initial capital? How did you gather, and how did you actually uh, go further to uh, to invest in terms of uh, raising your capital? That is. Yeah. Uh, for the company, I'm just a marketing manager. Okay. The, the promoters of the company. Okay. And the directors. All right. Because in many occasions, mm -hmm. the pro promoters are ready to. In a former business mm -hmm. and also to register it mm -hmm. but you see you you need the other parties yeah exactly you need to work as a team definitely so the managerial aspect of it that's what you represent probably next time you can bring in the other people to, to help to. us go in through next time i'll come up with us uh, i will come with a sample of the water yes you should absolutely yeah. so for from where you're seated and uh, acting as a manager right Take us through the aspect of how important it is to just, uh, uh, in terms of uh, visualizing the business and helping into bringing out the, the vision of the, you know, the sole owners into existence. Uh, that's an interesting question. And uh, in many occasions, most of the businesses fail to answer. Mm -hmm. But you see, for our case, uh, for, 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 you, for you to exist in the market, uh, you need to do the right thing. You need to always look at what the customers need. Because mm -hmm. it's, it's not all about the company. Mm -hmm. It's all about the uh, potential clients. What do they need? So for our case, uh, we, thought it, uh, we thought that we should, take, uh, we should wear the shoe of the client. Okay. Yes, to see what, you, what are the benefits of our products. Mm -hmm. And uh, immediately we answer that question, mm -hmm. I can assure you. It's a startup, but we are doing great. Okay, yeah. so a couple of uh, marketing uh, strategies that strategies that you have put into place. Uh, looking forward to 2021 because I know you guys are already on the move. So marketing strategies to scale up the business in 2021. Some of the marketing strategies that we do uh, to think of for 2021 mm -hmm. is to do more of uh, the online platform because mm -hmm. you see for every business. Uh, since the existence of uh, COVID-19 here, physical uh, meeting clients is quite uh, cumbersome, given that most of the clients doesn't want you to meet because you meet many clients, so one of them might be having COVID-19. So you will be transferring one of them, or uh, the COVID-19, to the next client. So most of them are preferring the online platform where they place an order, you do the, uh, the order, you process the ordering process and uh, deliver to them. Mm -hmm. They make payments. So uh, for our case, since it's a startup company, we're a startup company, we have done uh, many platform, online platforms that, sing, that will see us through 2021. Given currently is a, a ceremonial season, Whereby we have events, we have weddings, mm -hmm. uh, things we have look favorable parties, to you. Yeah, guys. that is favorable to us. Mm -hmm. So, uh, these are seen as uh, through the 2020. Mm -hmm. And we are seeing that given 2021, we'll do better. Mm -hmm. mm. All right. So, what are a couple of uh, financial uh, uh, lessons that you've learned along the way and that you've implemented in the company just to ensure that it continues to profe propel forward? You see, some of the financials, uh, financial strategies that we do have for every startup company, mm -hmm. we, you don't have to look for profit mm -hmm. at its uh, commencement. Okay. 
every little profit you get, blur back mm. to make sure the company grows. Because you see in business, it's all about economies of scale. Mm -hmm. When you do small, you will gain small. Mm -hmm. But when you do big, you will gain big. As much as there is a, a risk trade off, a risk return trade off, whereby the more the risks, the more the money. But you see, for most of the people, they do try to avoid risks and they want to gain more. But in this scenario, the more you risk, mm -hmm. the more probability that you will gain more. There's no assurance. There is no assurance. <laughs> so for every entrepreneur, for mm -hmm. every uh, how we do at Faida mm -hmm. Limited, mm -hmm. we don't mind about the gain that we have. Mm -hmm. We are looking forward to the bigger picture okay. of the company. All right. So what are a couple of mechanisms that your company, uh, uh, the company has actually uh, put together to stay afloat during this time of COVID? And, um, making it clear that you guys just started recently. So how did you guys keep afloat? Afloat, afloat during the time of COVID? Uh, during this time, mm -hmm. we had pulled our resources okay. to ensure that this is a moment that is tough. Mm -hmm. It's a recession for every company. Mm -hmm. If it's a recession for the Kenya economy, mm -hmm. what of the individual companies? Mm -hmm. What of an individual person? Mm -hmm. So, because when you are looking at the economy of every, uh, of every country, it ge generates to the aggregate from individual to aggregate. But you see for now, since the aggregate is uh, doing badly, we are in a recession as a country. The same, same case, we are in a recession as a company. But since we started at the recession, we did ensure that we have enough resources to run us through this uh, period and to ensure that we are existing. Because mm -hmm. uh, being a startup company, you can easily be kicked off by the economic aspect mostly the finance aspect of the company. Since you are starting, you, are, uh, you have ambitions that by the end of the year, I'll be making a lot of profit. Mm. But all of a sudden, <laughs> there are no sales. Expectations. Uh, those expectations are not met, mm -hmm. and the company has to exist. Uh, there you go. So how many employees uh, within the company? We have a variety of employees, because uh, we don't only deal uh, our geographical uh, region is okay. not only Nairobi. Okay, probably it's could tell us uh, the regions of the country. It's across the country. Okay, how many uh, counties? The whole counties. We are in Kisumu, we are in Mombasa. 47 counties? Yes, uh, okay. but currently we are in 30 counties. Uh -huh, yeah, yeah. So we are looking forward to, to being there. To stretch into the other counties. Yes, yeah, sure, sure. All right, so what are a couple of challenges that you're facing in the business? Most of the challenges we are facing in the business are... As a startup, that is. As a startup. Mm -hmm. This is to do with uh, economic order mm -hmm. from the clan. Mm -hmm. You see, most of the clans doesn't know about the economic order quantity. It's just like a press of a pattern. They make order, mm -hmm. they make order, mm -hmm. and expect you to deliver immediately. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For our case, we have the economic budget quantity. Mm -hmm. That is, uh, we have uh, a number of uh, quantities in our stores. Mm -hmm. But you see, when a client, the ordering process takes time. Mm -hmm. A day, or have a day, depending mm -hmm. on uh, the location of the client. Mm -hmm. So uh, one thing we, were, we are facing, because if a client makes an order mm -hmm. uh, and requires it immediately, it becomes a challenge. Two is concerning the employee. Mm -hmm. You see, to get the right employees is always quite cumbersome. Mm -hmm. That person who owns mm -hmm. the idea. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You employ someone, they only see salary. They don't see the, the performance aspect. Because oh. if you are owning the idea mm -hmm. of the company, mm -hmm. it means you will deliver mm -hmm. to see you through you are aligned to the vision of the company that sure, is. Sure, sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. So where do you look at? Uh, let's go to... Maybe before that. Okay. <laughs> uh, another challenge is concerning the competition. Ah. But you told us earlier when you said this competition, uh, Runo, you said it's competition healthy. is not... It's healthy, it's but not... it's a challenge. <laughs> it's not an issue. I okay. can assure you that. Okay. But, uh, for example, uh -huh. it's Y254. 
there is this other station. Yeah, we, we are not going there. We are the best, you know. We you are the best. for the young people properly. Sure. Mm. 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 <laughs> but you should like knowledge there is competition. <laughs> <laughs> so, Bruno, uh, let's look at uh, three years down the road. Mm. Where do you see the, the FIDA uh, Spring Limited? Three years down the road. Yes. We are seeing FIDA outside the country mm -hmm. doing amazing okay. deliveries. All right. Across the country across the country, across uh -huh. the borders, because we are not looking forward to only Kenya. Mm -hmm. And it's the same, but beyond mm -hmm. the territories of Kenya. All right. Yeah. Okay, so I am looking forward to having this conversation uh, in, in a few few months or few years down the road. You never know. I'll be here. Yes. I'm going nowhere. Okay, so how can people find you uh, in, across all social media handles uh, if they want to reach out for you? You know, it's a festive season. Sure. People will want to have a good time and drink and probably they would like to reach out to you. Uh, we have a Facebook page mm -hmm. that is uh, Faida Springs Limited. Mm -hmm. Faida and then Space mm -hmm. Springs, mm -hmm. then LTD, not mm -hmm. Limited. Mm -hmm. It's LTD. Mm -hmm. And then we are also on IG, mm -hmm. that is Faida Spring. Mm -hmm. Faida and then Space Springs. Okay. Yeah. All right. And also... Most of the clients mm -hmm. need an immediate feedback. Okay. So mm -hmm. uh, we our email is faidasprings at gmail dot com. Okay. And also our contacts. If you need immediate feedback, it's oh seven nine one five zero three seven one four. All right. Uh, you can call any time. Mm -hmm. You place your order. I can assure you, you will be delivered your products. Ronald assured you. Okay, thank you very much for creating time to be with us talking about uh, the w w water production plant that you guys are running. So, you've seen a couple of months, of couple of years? Couples of months, mm -hmm. invite me here. Oh, you're much welcome and we'll have this conversation all over again. I will be right here. <laughs> thank you very much.